Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kritika and I do post makeup related videos on this channel. And in today's video, I'll be creating this super gorgeous makeup look for Eid. So if you are really interested in knowing how I create this look, then please keep on watching. I'm starting by applying a moisturizer and it's from Joy Skin Fruits, but you can apply any moisturizer you like. And after that, I'm going to apply foundation and I'm using this Maybelline Fit Me foundation and it's in the shade 115 and I'll be applying it all over my face with the help of a beauty blender. After that, I'm going to apply concealer and this concealing palette is from Kiss Beauty and I'll be applying the concealer over my eyelids and then I'll blend it out with the help of a beauty blender. Now I'm picking up this shade with the help of an angle brush and I'll be filling up my brows and by the way that eyeshadow palette is from Hilary Rota. Now I'm picking up this powdery shade and I'll be applying it all over my eyelids just to set the concealer and after that I'm applying a cello tape on the outer V of my eyelid. I'm picking up this light green shade and I'll be applying it all over my eyelid with the help of eyeshadow blending brush and then I'm picking up this dark green shade and I'm applying it on the outer V and in a corner of my eyelid. I'll be mostly focusing on the outer side and inner side. Now I'm picking up the same dark green shade with the help of a pencil brush and I'm applying it mostly focusing on the outer side of my eyelid and the inner side and I'm also applying it onto the crease line just to define my crease. I'm applying concealer onto the center of my lid and I'll blend it out with the help of my finger. And now I'm applying this beautiful gold shimmery shade on the center of my eyelid. Now I'm picking up this grey shade with the help of this pencil brush and I'll be applying it onto the outer corner and inner corner joining by the crease line just to give some more depth to my eyes and I'll blend it out with the help of a blending brush and I'm applying some more shimmers onto the center of my lid. And this is how my both eyes are looking. Now I am going to draw eyeliner and this eyeliner is from Lakme 9 to 5 range. To coat my lashes I am applying mascara and this mascara is from Kiss Beauty. Now I'm picking up this dark green shade and I'm applying it closure towards my lower lash line and I'm applying a gold shimmer closure towards my inner corner of the lower lash line. It's time to add some dimensions to my face so I'm contouring my face and I'm contouring my cheekbones, my jawline and my forehead. I'm going to conceal the highest points of my face and I'm using a highlighting concealer. I'll be concealing under my eye area, my bridge of the nose, my cupid's bow, my chin and the center of my forehead. And I'll blend this all out by using a beauty blender. Now to set my concealer, I am applying a compact powder and this powder is from Maybelline Fit Me. And here you can see I am contouring my nose roughly. And just to set the product inside my skin, I am using a beauty blender and doing a dabbing motion onto my face. Now I am picking up these two pinkish shades from the eyeshadow palette and I am applying it onto, my, onto the apples of my cheeks and I am applying it a little bit on my nose and on my chin as well. 
we have come to the last part of the face makeup and that's the highlighting so i'm applying highlighter on the highest points of my face like on my cheekbones on the bridge of my nose on my cupid's bow on my chin and on the center of my forehead and i'm also highlighting my brow bone as well i'm giving some finishing touches to my eye makeup and at the last i'm applying kajal onto my waterline I'm completing this makeup by applying this lipstick. This is a beautiful maroonish reddish kind of lipstick. And here I'm wearing this beautiful earrings to complement my look. And I'm applying a bindi on the center of my forehead. And this is my final finished look. I hope you guys like this look. You can wear this look with or without dupatta and you would look awesome. And if you like this look then please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel and also comment down below. And you can also follow me on Instagram. And I'll see you guys with a brand new video. Till then bye, take care and Eid Mubarak guys.